Hello and welcome to PicturesToScrapbook.com. Today we're going to talk about managing and organizing your digital photos. I thought it would be easier to show you my system rather than just writing about it. This is a good system to start now and going forward when you add new photos from your digital camera or your phone. You can then go back and organize the photos on your hard drive when you have time. I do not want you to be overwhelmed by this process. It should make your life easier and not harder. So take it slow and work in small chunks of time. I'm on a PC with Windows 7, but this would be similar to what you can do with an older version of Windows or even on a Mac. My Windows has a library called Pictures where my digital photos are stored. Um, older versions of Windows may have this folder in the My Documents folder. Here on the left hand side you can see that um, I have pictures and listed under my pictures library is um, a series of years going all the way back to 2003 and um, with each new year I just add a new folder and for instance we can go on into 2011 and from here you can see that all of my uh, folders are labeled by the month so they're in chronological order um, one way that I ensure they're in chronological order is by adding a one and a dash in front of the month um, representing that month for instance one for January two for February etc uh, this just keeps everything in chronological order when they're sorted by name. You can see I have a couple of extra folders here and those are just special folders for um, some family photos and for a calendar that I did as some gifts. And um, back in 2011 I also attempted to do Project 365 which was taking a photo every day of the year and I was a major dropout. I think I made it to February. Um, but anyway, uh, so if we click on January, you can see that I have um, all of my January photos here. And I also have a um, folder that's called Edited. And what I like to do is um, have this folder so that I can put my pictures there that I've edited in either Photoshop or possibly even Lightroom now. Um, this just allows me to find them easily for uploading to my photo processor. Um, I almost always edit my photos in some way, even if it's just to resize them, before uploading them to the website for printing. Now, if you're not sure of the date on a photo, you can see that there are dates next to each of my photos. And um, if you don't have this, you can right-click and select it from the uh, checkboxes here. Um, there's also a date taken um, selection that you can do and what that allows you to do is um, to see when it was taken with a digital camera. If it's a scanned photo or a photo that doesn't have that you may just have to go by the um, the date that's listed here uh, which is basically the creation date. Um, so basically that's it. I hope this tutorial has been helpful, and if you have any comments or questions, please go to pictures2scrapbook.com. I'd love to hear from you. Thank you.